Hello, I'm Andy and I'm going to read to you a very interesting program called Career, Job, Business, Lotteries, speculate, Financial Speculation, Stock Market, How to Get Your Best Dates and How to Get Your Best um, Numbers. But first I want to talk, give you a bit of a review regarding your job for the month of October for you coming from Gemini. Now the first 20 days or so are going to be very difficult for you, I'm sorry, the first 20 days or so are going to be very good for you and you're going to be very lucky in your area of job, in your area of business. So give it your all. They are short-term planets, they are long-term planets and they make you very lucky in terms of expecting what you want in your job area or in your business area. So be busy. Your last 10 days remain pretty good except that you tend to be very restless and very pushy and a bit over-determined. Overdetermined means wanting to get what you want at all costs in your area of career or job or lottery tickets. Take it easy. That's the best way. Let the energies flow nicely. You are going to do well enough in your last 10 days of October in areas of job. Now, if you are in business, your, your month for the October, the first 20 days are going to be excellent. And they produce profits and they produce possibilities of good news in areas of business. You can beat the competition if you're chasing a contract. Expansion is seen. Very good news. Your last 10 days are also good enough, but they show that you are inclined to take financial risk unnecessarily in the last 10 days. So don't allow that to happen. That's the obstacle you can create for yourself. Now I'm going to give you, for you coming from Gemini, um, your lucky dates. In every month, whether it's the worst month or the best, there will be extreme lucky dates waiting for you to help you in everything you want to do. And in your case, apply to your job, your business, when to buy lottery tickets, when to go to casino, when to go into the stock market, things like that. The dates I've chosen for you are the 4th, the 13th, the 22nd and the 31st of October. You get very lucky on these dates, morning, noon, afternoon, evening and night time. So use this, bookmark these dates, 4, 13, 22 and 31st and be active in the financial area or making financial decisions or planning to make financial moves of any kind. Now I'm going to give you your lucky ages. There will be some people who fall under these ages and they become extremely lucky. If you happen to be the ages of 17 or 26, or 35 or 44 or 53 or 62 or 71 or even 80 then you're going to be one very lucky person in the month of october for you coming from gemini and keep that in mind you are somebody special in the month of october if you don't happen to be these ages don't panic it just means you have to be you will still get the very good news but perhaps don't just take overly too much risk now, regarding lotteries, I've chosen sets of numbers for you. What I'm doing is I'm narrowing the field of numbers. Ultimately, you'll have to choose it from your own energy. Remember that I'm doing it for everybody born in the period of Gemini. Millions and millions and millions of horoscopes there. And so it's not specially for you. For you, one day I would like to use your date of birth and your time of birth and look at your palms and I'll face read your face while we Skype and I can use Kabbalistic tarot cards based on your date of birth. That will be a special horoscope made for you. In the meantime, here is a general horoscope for all Gemini. The numbers I've chosen for you are the number 4, just write this down, number 4, 13, 22, 31, 40, 49 or 58. Now, some lotteries go up to 60 numbers, some up to 70 numbers, you choose like that, okay? But these are the numbers which I've, I've come upon, which are very strong. 4, 13, 22, 31, 40, 49 or 58. So keep that in mind. I've given you another set of numbers to widen the scope a bit. And the second set of numbers, which doesn't mean that the second set is less important than the first set. The second set of numbers are the 5th, the 14th, the 23rd, the 32, 41, 50 and 59. So from these numbers I've given you, there lies the energy for people from Gemini to somehow come very close to making it in the field of lotteries. Okay. Now, from these sets of numbers, you must relate these numbers to your personal life. Does any of this number, is it your age? 
Does any of these number the age of your children or your spouse or your boyfriend or the people you are with or family members? Is it related to your address, to your phone number, the last four digits? Is it relating to your car number? If these numbers connect with anything about you or anything you relate with, then choose these numbers. So choose that way. The other thing I do is I realize that our uh, energies escape through our fingers, through the tip of your nose, the tip of your ears, the tip of your toes, anywhere the extremities are in our body, energy must leave. It has to leave, otherwise we will explode. And so, some of the good energy also leaves you. So we want to capture that good energy. And you, for you coming from Gemini, I would like you to use your thumbs of both hands. Doesn't matter if you're left or right-handed, use both hands and use your thumb and connect it to the ring finger this way and then concentrate in the area of job or is it the area of business or is it the area of lotteries is it the area of the stock market of to channel this energy so energy will leave you through your ring finger but wants to leave you but it cannot it's connected to your thumb and the almighty thumb will bring it back so this energy builds up you can take a minute five minutes ten minutes whenever you under stress do this and you will channel your good energy back to strengthen your thoughts, your mind levels as well. And so for financial speculation, do this, get this energy into you for one, two, three, four, five minutes, whatever. Some say, can I say a prayer? Go ahead. Some say, I cannot think of it. Just go ahead and do what you feel like. And then uh, choose your numbers from the selections I've given you. What I do sometimes for myself is that I um, uh, uh, cut out little one inch by one inch uh, little bits of paper and on each of them I write a number so it's number one the next one will be number two the next one will be number three and so it goes on and on like that I'll have maybe 60 numbers there and so I'll have 60 bits of crumpled papers and I just spread them on my table and I'll just pick them one by one to choose my six or seven numbers that your lottery demands from you and so I will open them and say oh I've chosen number six very good so I'm writing number six Oh, I've chosen number 18, I'll write number 10. So, so the energy from your, from your fingers is making you pick those numbers up. Sometimes I also will write numbers on a plain sheet of paper, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, in a neatly uh, up to number 60. And then I'll take a pen and I'll just use my energies and concentrate and I'll, without opening my eyes, I'll just put my pen down and if it falls on number 15, let's say, I'll write down where well, I want to buy number 15 and I will choose my numbers that way. That's what I do for myself. I use my energies coming up from the extremities. So you try and do that as well. And even if you are under stress of any kind, whether it's love connected, money connected, health connected, do this, connect this and can level your energy, your level will go up, the positive energy. You find your stress coming down. Do this as often as you can. While you're walking, there's no thing like yoga to get into positions. Uh, no, while you're walking, while you're sitting watching TV or at work, while you're whatever when you're doing, when you're sleeping, just do that and you'll capture a lot of energy. Well, I'm already Skyping and I'm charging USD 50, 50 for a 90 minute Skype session with me. That will be based on your date of birth, on your time of birth, looking at your palms and I'll face read you as well and um, use Kabbalistic tarot if you like me to as well. And with all that information, I will then uh, do a personal horoscope for you for your next five or six years in all areas of your life, be it love, romance, marriage, family, health, finances, job, uh, business, whatever. So go to Facebook, go to um, Skype, uh, send me an email, make contact with me and let's get down to Skype so that I can get your five, next five or six years perfectly right for you. Until then, thank you and good luck.